At 5.30 tonight, the Haverhill family of a man who was killed in a construction accident is mourning his loss. 41-year-old Carlos Ortiz died after falling down an elevator shaft. WBZ's Paul Burton spoke with his family. And I think just not having him there when I expect him to always be there, that's what makes this so hard. Bailey Ortiz fights back tears knowing this Christmas will be a lot different after the tragic death of her father, Carlos Ortiz. I just never imagined that I would lose him when he didn't get to see me graduate or walk me down the aisle at my wedding. Investigators say on Tuesday the 41-year-old roofer fell down an elevator shaft and died at a construction project on Essex Street in Haverhill. The DA's office is investigating the incident. I heard that it was eight stories, and that day I know it was very, very windy, and I don't know if that played part in it. Bailey says her father worked for more than 11 years as a roofer, most recently here on Essex Street where he lost his life on the job. Now he leaves behind his wife and three young daughters just a week before Christmas. My mom is just mostly concerned about being able to pay for rent and for, like, the electricity and for food. Family, friends, and strangers are coming together to help support the family during this difficult time. Today, she decorates her Christmas tree surrounded by her extended family, something her father loved to do. What do you miss most about Dad? I'm just not having his presence there. I just feel so empty. I just feel like there's just a hole in my chest where he used to be. The 20-year-old junior at UMass Lowell says she will continue to get her degree in criminal justice, something her father strongly supported. He did what he did was so I could have that dream because he knew that was my dream too. And right now I just want to be able to do that for him and walk across that stage for him. In Haverhill, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.